Everyone thinks they know what it takes to become a champion. But so few actually face the hurdles that litter the road to victory. To claim the Aegis takes everything you can muster. More than you even knew you had. Thompson waiting under the tower. He's just tanking through all of it. A triple kill for Thompson. And now the jump in from oh. three man and the Kroner. Toss them down. This may just be it with none of them. You need the courage to fight. The will to overcome adversity. The confidence to outlast doubt. Oh, keep it so You need to stand tall against your enemies and embrace the strengths of your friends. You will be tested. You can jump in if you want to, thinking about it. Be sure to open up GH, the Echo Slam. Is it quite going to be enough to have the Ravage to try and turn it? We are so freaking low as they all are getting torn apart, Nisha. You will be battered and bent, but never broken. You will follow in the footsteps of legends and trust that someday others will follow in yours. Activate Soul Catcher on him, press the attack though, helping him out, Earth Splitter. Oh, but they, they found the duel! They caught on, man, he's dead for two minutes! The volley's coming in, but it's not good enough! OG are going to the grand finals from the... You will understand the magnitude of each moment. Without losing sight of the prize ahead. Because you know this is your time. This is your fight. It's all on the line. Things were a bit dark. Uh, my dog had died, and um, yeah, it was, it was really rough oh for a couple God. of weeks. Sorry. My, my self esteem was pretty low, and <laughs> now we're here. <laughs> Seven there already just talking about hero picks and stuff, but who knew that he was actually talking about OG being able to make a run through a lower bracket? They want Karoki in the fountain as well. They're gonna get it, they're chasing Miracle as well. Oh my god, I can't believe this. I can't believe what we're seeing in this game for OG. You throw your sword on the game too, you throw your sword on the game too. There it is, no! OG! But then they hit the brick wall. Oh geez, they're the, the best, best team in the world. They're, they're on a completely no different question, level. No question, they are so far ahead of anybody else that plays this game for a living. Game two, three, and four were absolutely ridiculous. The showing was magical from OG. They just seem to know exactly what to do with whatever trap they're giving. It doesn't matter. They have so many different traps, so many different play styles. They can execute all of them. Liquid. 
seemed like they stood How no long? chance after that first and game. And they've earned their money, $15 million, just over in fact, going the way of OG for this victory, on top of the $11 million they won last year. On... The team, I believe, preparing to lift up what is rightfully theirs for the second time in error. There he is, Sam himself, speeding the crew up to the podium. You cannot help but be awestruck by what this team has shown us in this entire run in these two years. And now the grand finals, ladies and gentlemen. Okay,呃,Notel,可以说,那我相信在这一刻,他们作为卫冕冠军,并且再次夺得天下冠军一定有很多话想说,那我们现在问一下,呃,队长Notel,现在有什么话想对他们的粉丝和对Dota2的粉
You know, they're not busting open the door. They're not running to see everyone else because it's, it's what's in there. You know, that counts. They, they got them there again. It's unbelievable what the, this team managed to do in the end. Two times uh, winning uh, TI and the Dota for them, Dota for pretty much all of us is uh, life. Dota is love and uh, we should just keep playing the game. I can't believe that w what we just witnessed. I mean, just look at the way that uh, they won and they, they come out. <laughs> And poor Dove, she's, she's like trying to get the interview going. And, and the team cares nothing about that. They just care about sharing this happiness with each other, sharing this happiness with their family that has supported them through this very tough road that they originally had to go through to win the TI. I'm sure it feels a little bit uh, easier the second time around, but God, this is just uh, what an insane way to be able to just go through just running people nonstop. I mean, it's it must just good be. Dotes. Like just a wave, right? Of like yeah. each thing hitting you, it's like, oh my god, we did it. He won TI again, and then it's like, oh my god, we just won all this money again. Oh my god, I'm gonna be carrying Iowa on the agency. <laughs> <laughs> so many things are flying through there right now. It's, it's like waking up from uh, this moment over and over again. Well, you can't believe that you actually did it, and uh, there you are once again. Sad. For both sides, all the friends and family is like they've been giving a spot like on the floor, on the stage floor, so that they can witness it super close by, but also so that they can either be there to share the happy moment or be there to share the sad moment. And of course, in OG's case, they were cheering and rowdy. But as uh, OG was uh, once again. I'm not probably, they are the best team that we ever witnessed in Dota for sure. It's such a fun play style to be able to go. What a good, what a good team for Dota too. And how fitting that, that IO carry is the one that is going to be on all the ages is that that's going to be there because it all starts with the story of being able to, of be able to trust your teammates, right? They want to be able to do something and being able to just fearlessly say, go for it. It, it embodies the from the tethering to one another to the, yeah, we never practiced this, let's go to the group stage and destroy it. And, it, and it's working out, you know? And we all, we've all seen two sides. You know, we all know in what fashion they, they won the first one time round. Like, what do you like to play, you know? Not what is the style, not what is good here or something, or not what is the strategy. No, 
now, what would you like to play in the final game of the Grand Finals of the International Olympics? I'll tell you what, I've heard that Yohan is a, a big fan of, uh, of Wings and still looks back and watches those games. And I, I think it's kind of evident in their play style. It's like, yeah, because if no other team has made me have those emotions and thoughts like the day one, I'm just like so befuddled, but so insanely impressed. And I'm just like, what are these guys doing? How is this working? And they are catching everyone off guard now. They took the four back of two years. Yeah. And we saw Anna with that agent in his third international. It's all been all the all the old way for him. All we're doing is taking it tournament by tournament, game by game. If you look too far ahead, you lose yourself. 